Okay, next we are going to grab the WebQuest template and I've taken a shortcut that you can certainly pause and catch up to me with and I have navigated to our Moodle site which is moodle.rst2.edu and on the left hand side I'm going to click on Core Courses. Once again I'm going to click on any of my brain sections and I'm going to go to Dreamweaver. Once here on the left hand side click on All Templates and here we have the basic WebQuest template. Now once again I am using Internet Explorer if I were using a different browser I would have to save these by opening this file and grabbing the code alternately from Firefox I can also click on file save as once I'm looking at the front page of the WebQuest templates it is important to understand that every one of these is a separate page and a separate file therefore each of these have to be saved individually this particular page is the home page or the index of the actual web quest. So in order to save this particular page I'm going to come up here to the word file. I'm going to come down to save as and just as I've done throughout I want to make sure that I save it in the correct location. Currently my browser is pointing me into my thumb drive but let me go ahead and click on that one more time if I weren't sure I would simply click on computer and here are all of the drives available here's my thumb drive I'm going to double click on that here is my name folder I'm going to double click on that this time I do want to go into my brain section and I want to go into the folder called final because that's where this template should go now I'm going to come down here to where it says save as type and I'm going to choose web page HTML only. Now I must remember to call this one index.html and I do want to type in the .html so it gets there as a complete .html and I'm going to go ahead and click on save and that's all there is to saving that file. I'm going to do the introduction next. I'm going to click on the word introduction and here is the introduction file. Once again I'm going to click on the word file, save as. Now this time it automatically dropped me into the correct folder simply because I'd already done so. I'm going to come down to the bottom, choose web page HTML only this time I want this to be called introduction dot HTML notice that all of these are lowercase no spaces and they are just the simple word to describe the page in this case this is the introduction this is the introduction dot HTML page I'm going to click on save I'm going to do one more with you and then you'll be on your own in this particular case this page is the task page and I'm going to name it task for naming all of my other pages I would simply name them process evaluation conclusion credits and teacher so here we are at the task page and once again I'm going to click on the word file save as I'm going to come down and choose web page HTML only and I'm going to call this task.html and then I'm going to click on save. Now I want you to continue saving the WebQuest template. Remember you have to save the process, the evaluation, conclusion, credits, and the teacher page. And I'll talk to you in a few minutes.